I can't take no loss. I don't even know what it costs. This is day five of the program. Today we're gonna focus on shoulders, back, and some core. So let's go ahead. So we're gonna start a warm up with a band. Get the shoulders and chest really warmed up. We're gonna hit a rear delt fly. Okay, so then we're gonna go into a single arm lap pull down. You want it to be at a really high angle with the cable. And then you're gonna be quite a ways back from it. Shoulders stay down and back, but I'm gonna be hinged forward a little bit. Stretching the lat here, pulling down to that side. Okay, so we're gonna do a lateral raise on the bench. So our chest is gonna be supported. Shoulders stay down and back. We're gonna swing these out, hitting that lateral head of the shoulder. And just controlling on the way back down. Let's hit 10 to 12 here. We definitely wanna go past that burn. And then we're gonna go into a front raise. So I like to scoot myself just a little bit more. We're gonna have the hands neutral for this one, focusing on the front shoulder. Trying to keep the traps nice and relaxed, shoulders down and back, letting the front shoulder do all that work. Okay, so then we're gonna go into a push-up. If you're able to do them full length, great. Hit as many as you can and then go down to knee push-ups. So we're gonna start in a high plank. Shoulders stay down and back. Keeping the core nice and tight as you come down. When you hit as many as you can do, down to knee push-ups. Still keep the core nice and tight. We wanna get 10 of these. We're gonna go into a bent over row. This is also gonna work on the lats. We're gonna do single arm. I like to have my back flat, but just a little bit up. I just feel it better in my lat having that little ways up. Think about keeping that elbow wide and controlling on the negative. So strong pull up, really nice and controlled on the way down. Okay, so for this one, you want pretty light dumbbells because we're gonna be holding on to them for a whole minute. So you're gonna have one arm start out at the side. The other one for 30 seconds is just gonna do as many raises as we can get. We're gonna feel the lateral shoulder here. And then once we hit that 30 seconds, switching. You really don't need more than five pounds for this to start, especially. So you'll do a full minute here, 30 seconds each side. So for the lap pull down, you wanna have a wide grip, just arms out in a Y is how I remember it. Shoulders are gonna stay down and back, slight lean into it. Controlling that negative. My arms are just the hooks. I think about my elbows, dragging that weight down, catching it with the lats. So then we're gonna set up with a narrow row, shoulders down and back, keeping those elbows wide as you come back, pushing that chest forward. Okay, so we're gonna do two core exercises at the end of this to finish us up. One is gonna be a jackknife. So we wanna focus on the whole abdominal chain. We're gonna come in, squeeze all the way out. We're also gonna do alternating toe taps. So focusing on this upper abs, breathing out as you come up. 
right, guys, that was day five. If you want to follow along for more content, go ahead and go to empire.com and you can buy the whole eight weeks or you can find it on my Instagram profile. Let me know what you think. Where do you want me to put this? Where do you want me to put this? Hmm? I can't take no loss. I don't even know what it